Hello gentlemen, this is Khan Baba. Today is 20 of February, Tuesday afternoon. Welcome everybody, wherever you're tuned in from and, we love you and we're glad you're here. Today we will discuss about Vietnam Dong. So let's start the today information. The year 2024 continues to look good for Vietnam's foreign investment attraction, as right from the beginning of this year. The country has attracted a host of projects. According to the Foreign Investment Agency under the Ministry of Planning and Investment, Vietnam had attracted more than $2.36 billion in foreign direct investment, FDI, as of January 20th, an increase of 40.2% over the same period in 2023. Specifically, on February 19th, authorities of the central province of Nagui and granted investment licenses to five foreign invested projects, with a total capital of $390 million. Notably among them were a $120 million project of Taiwan, China, S. Radiant Opto Electronics Corporation and a $115 million project of Hong Kong, China, S. Everwin Precision. In late October 2023, Everwind Precision also began work on a $200 million project at the Vietnam Singapore Industrial Park VSIP, in the central locality. Earlier, the northern province of Hai Duong handed over investment certificates to 27 projects, with a total capital of more than $1.5 billion. Besides several domestic projects, there are large-scale FDI projects, such as a $270 million stationary factory invested by Delhi Vietnam Office Technology Company, Limited. There was also a project worth $260 million by Beale Crystal Vietnam Manufacturing Limited, and a Boviet Hai Duong solar photovoltaic cell factory worth $120 million. Among nine projects granted investment certificates in early January in the southern province of Dong Nai, there were four foreign invested, totaling $156.4 million. Meanwhile, $217 million were added to four existing FDI projects. Speaking at a recent government meeting with localities, Deputy Prime Minister Le Min Kai stressed that Vietnam remains an attractive destination to foreign investors, given the fact that up to $36.6 billion was registered, and $23.2 billion was disbursed last year. These are the highest ever figures. Michael Kakalari, Director of Vena Capitals. Macroeconomic Analysis and Market Research Department, assessed that Vietnam's attraction of Foreign investment in 2024 will continue to be very positive. He shared that his firm has received a lot of information about Japanese groups looking for opportunities to cooperate with domestic units, such as Vena Capital, to pour capital into Vietnam's real estate sector. Other fields that promise to attract large capital flows may be manufacturing and retail. Thank you and goodbye.